and good evening Toastmasters. I've just come from an executive committee meeting and I've got some very exciting news for all of you. I'm going to announce to you tonight the subs increase for the next six months. So I knew you'd find that exciting. <laughs> you, have, you have in front of you, as one of your handouts, a, uh, a spreadsheet that I prepared earlier, which is the Gosford City Toastmasters cash flow for the 12 months of the 31st of January 2017, which is the latest 12 month period that I have. Before I go into that cash flow, I want to explain to you what our subs consist of here. We pay subscriptions on a six monthly basis and the period of subs is from the uh, 1st of April each year until the 30th of September and the 1st of October through the 31st of March. So we're just coming up to the 31st of March subs request and it was our assignment tonight as the executive committee to set the subs for the next six months. Now, the way the subs are built up is primarily from the amount of money that we need to pay Toastmasters International on a six monthly basis. And that, unfortunately, is the rub because we have to pay in US dollars. The amount is $45 US. Now, if anybody can tell me what the exchange rate will be, what I will have to pay in Aussie dollars in, in that period when I pay it in March, April and in September, October, please raise your hand and tell me and I'll... <laughs> Thank you, because I'll, I'll put it into a spreadsheet. I know you've all got your... I know, you, I know we all know the spot rate's around about 77 cents and it's very strong at the moment, but we don't get spot. We have a bank spread, we have bank charges. We probably get effectively somewhere around 70, 72 cents. Which means, in order for us to break square on simply what we have to pay to Toastmasters International, the $45 US, it's round about $62 Aussie that we have to pay. Now you're aware that we are currently paying $60 as our subs on a, on a six monthly basis. So we are basically behind the eight ball. I mean, we don't know. I mean, we know what the subs have been. In fact, I'll, I'll draw your attention to the cash flow for last year. If you have a look on the right hand side of the page, you'll see the income, and you'll see uh, down one, two, three, four, five lines April membership renewals were $1,286. $1,286 is what I collected from you guys. What I had to pay to Toastmasters International is on the left hand side and for the April membership it was $1,408, so we lost money. And likewise in October, I collected $1,370 and paid $1,416. So we're eating into our reserves by keeping our subs at $60. We're unable, we're unable to do that, and the Executive Committee recognised that at our meeting this evening. So, as I said, we, we break square round about $62, rounded up 65 we also have expenses to pay, and you can see on the left-hand side, once again, under the expenditure heading, some of the expenses that we have to pay on an annual basis. For the last 12 months, we paid entry fees for the competitions at the area, which is $35 each time. There are two of those in a year, so you'll notice one for $35 for a humorously speaking competition, and the other one down there is international speech competition entry fee, $35. And then we had the post office box, $121. Uh, oh, we had a one-off for Jackson Global, Gable's funeral, uh, funeral uh, flowers for $133. Uh, trophies were $75. All of these expenses add up. We've, uh, we're going to do some advertising for new members, and that's probably going to cost us another $250 this half year. So we can very easily add another $10 per head. We've got 23 members at the moment, so $10 per head is only only $230 for the half year, we can very easily add another $10 to what our break even is on the, on the $62, which takes our break even point to somewhere around the 62 to 70, uh, sorry, the 72 to $75 Aussie mark, which is an increase, if we were to approve it, of $15 per member per half year, from $60 to $75. However, I have some good news for you. At the Executive Committee meeting tonight, we decided not to break square. We're going to, depending upon the exchange rate, we may not, and depending upon how we handle our expenses, 
we may be able to break square with $66. How does $66 sound to you, Toastmasters, rather than $75? Good. Good. $9 less. Yes, Fantastic news. So that's basically where we are with the, with the subs. Now, bear in mind that your executive committee operates for 12 months and our term will come to an end on the 30th of June, so we're only approving this for the next six months. When the new executive comes in, they will have another meeting and determine fees for the following six months. I throw the questions to you now. Are there any members who have any questions that they'd like to ask? Uh, yes, Gary. Uh, what are the fees for new members? Ah, I'm glad you asked, Gary. Thank you. Our new members, uh, we're, we're simply asking because Toastmasters International pay at we have to pay Toastmasters International for new members. There are expenses associated with booklets, etc., for new members. It's $54 joining fee, and then on top of that will be their subs, would be $66. If somebody wants to join tonight, $120 for the, for the six months, but that includes a one off $54, <laughs> and then plus the, plus the subs. Stuart. Um. I'd like to ask, what's the difference between $75 and $60? $15. $15. That's an easy one, thank you. How many beers is that? How many beers? Yeah. Uh, $15. Yeah. be about seven and a half beers. Seven and a half beers? Seven and a half, two, uh, five beers. Three. Five beers? Three, Three beers. 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 Isn't it better to get it up to 75 on the basis that three beers, people are drinking anyway? Isn't that bad that we have to go? Well, I'm, sorry, well, I'm sorry, what was your point, Stuart? So I, I propose that we go for $75 because really in okay. the scheme of things, yeah. well, not, not, th not a hassle. Th thanks very much for your question, Stuart. And I, I support your sentiment, however, the decision has been made by the Executive Committee for you, so that you don't have to worry about making the decision yourselves. But thank you for that observation, Stuart. Any more questions? John. As somebody who's never been here before, uh, what, uh, what is the reason for paying the Americans uh, 45 US? 45 US. Yeah, good question. Uh, the Toastmasters program is a very documented program that includes a whole lot of learning and they're just about to change the learning experience into what's known as pathways, which you'll hear more about if you join us. There is a lot of documentation involved, there's a lot of toing and froing with the United States who run it for us. Some people would unkindly say that Toastmasters International are gouging us, I don't agree. I think that anybody who can get the kind of education that we get from Toastmasters for $11 a month, anybody that can do any better than that, I think, uh, you know, go for it. For $11 a month, Toastmasters membership, I think, is, is fantastic. Getting back to your question, $45 US, or over $65, yeah, there's documentation, there's... Could anybody else help me on what Toastmasters International provide? They also provide uh, running of our support system here in Australia. So yeah. part of those yep. fees goes towards paying our districts and our areas. Correct, yeah. yeah. So, so that, that, those fees. And, and in fact, the district, I think, retains some of those fees. Elaine? It is an American program. Yeah. It's not a Toastmasters program. Yeah. It is an American Well done, Lane. Thanks very much. Look, I am running out of time. I'm going to just take one more. I think Jerry had his hands up first. Um, but Toastmasters is a franchise, right? We are a branch of Toastmaster International. Any franchise will charge a fee. Mm. And that's what Toastmaster is doing. Yep. Well done. Thanks very much, Jerry. I conclude my press conference. Thank you very much, Toastmasters.